Hello everyone. Well, we have made it to our final destination. Now, hopefully, you have seen my previous vlogs and my Michiana adventures for the day. But we are at our final stop for the night. We are in St. Joseph, Michigan. Now, if you look back to one of my earliest vlogs, we were here in 2016 for the Luminary Fest. Well, we are back. But this time, it's a little different. It's the same festival. They're going to have the same stuff. But the weather is a lot better. Now, it's not super warm, but when we attempted to go here in 2016, it was very cold and very rainy, and the Luminary Fest was pretty much rained out. So, no rain today, no snow, it's a little bit cold, but we can definitely check everything out tonight, and it looks pretty packed. I drove through downtown already, and there's a lot of people, so it's going to be a fun day. But we are parked, and we are ready to head into town. Takes one token. You need to purchase tokens. You can get either at the machine outside the entrance to the carousel with the flashing light on top. And so that is the Silver Beach Carousel. Their Christmas display is one of my favorite things here in St. Joseph. And I discovered it for the first time when I vlogged and came here 
in 2016. The weather was a lot worse that day, but thankfully that was actually one of the few things that I could see indoors. Last time in 2016, a freight train came through here and about blew my eardrums out. Will we see a freight train today? We will find out. But nothing right now. Oh, and here's the Silver Beach Carousel. To get there, you have to drive through the downtown streets and wind your way around this way to this street. It's pretty easy to find if you look it up on Google Maps. But now, we need to follow the candles up the stairs to downtown St. Joseph. So all these bags have candles in them. It looks like sand to kind of weight them down a little. And of course, with the rain two years ago, none of these candles were lit, obviously. And, yeah, didn't really uh, have the same feel, so. Well, no rain or snow, but the wind sure has picked up quite a bit. It's a lot chillier now. They've come down here when it's like summer. If you are ever having problems finding parking downtown, which I guarantee you you will, head down to the carousel, again on this side road here, and there's a parking lot right in the back of the carousel. Free parking, uh, my car is in there, and there's a lot of free spaces. There's a little bit of walk to downtown, but it's close to the carousel, so that's good. But if you have a hard time finding a spot, this is a good spot to go. I think there's a parking lot a little bit farther that way towards the lake as well, and the beach, so definitely check it out if you need to. at first that a spaceship had crash landed here, but it looks like some sort of auditorium. A bunch of seating over there. And with that, welcome to St. Joseph's Luminary Fest. And we have reached the end. Time to head back this way.
And there you go. Another successful Memories by Wayne Michiana trip is in the books. Thank you, as always, for joining me on my journey. I really do enjoy visiting this town. It's very cute, and it's, you know, not too far from the Chicagoland area, but it feels like a whole other world. And the Luminary Fest is very nice as well. I enjoy that all the shops are open late, and it was a very nice time. Glad the weather was better this time around. Really though, overall for the whole trip, I have to say that I enjoyed the most the Dowagiak Area History Museum. That was a great find. I just spotted that on TripAdvisor and it was such, a, such an amazing experience to see something like that in a little town. They did such a great job, but uh, that is in one of my earlier vlogs, so make sure to check that out if you haven't checked it out yet. So, that ends this trip, but stay tuned. Don't quote me on it, but if all goes well, we may be back in the Michiana area as early as next spring. So we'll see what happens. Make sure to subscribe to our channel. And of course, don't forget to check us out on Facebook and Instagram as well. Thank you for watching.